know what? It was exciting and we had to share this with you. I was telling my wife that when we were coming up here, God was really dealing with my heart about David as a type of Yeshua and Getty. And just as we finished this clip a few moments ago, we was getting ready to leave here, and then one, the Holy Spirit revealed to me another thing that David was typing, the son of David, which is Yeshua. And that is when, when Saul was, came up into this mountain area to try to find David, and David was hidden in the cave. God puts like Saul like into a deep sleep or something, and David goes into the cave and takes and cuts the corner of his garment off. Now his men said, this is the hour you should slay him. The enemy of God, you should slay him. And David said, far be it from me to touch God's anointed. And what is this? It's incredible. Saul represents Israel in their exile of their blindness, of not knowing who Mashiach is. You see, the thing is, is David could have taken his life, but he said, far from it be from me, for me to touch God's anointed. And Israel is the anointed of God. And his men, they wanted to take his life. They wanted to kill him. Just as many people have wanted to annihilate the Jews today. But this is not what God wants. Do not touch his anointed. In fact, when Saul and his sons end up dying in battle, they end up the same place that the prophet Samuel is. So yes, they do give their lives later in battle, but God redeems them. They're still the anointed of God, and we do not touch the anointed of God. It's a beautiful type as he played out Yeshua so perfectly in this life. God bless you. Domingue Getty, Stephen and Yana Dumont. Baruch Hashem.